What's up everybody, it's Charlie and I'm back. So this is officially my two weeks out from surgery. I'm so freaking excited, but at the same time, I've had hesitations. It's like now that I'm here, I'm in such a state of disbelief that I'm doubting the work that I did to get here. Maybe I don't need medical intervention. I don't know, at the end of the day, I've been forgetting and doubting my journey. I kind of wanted to record this today to remind myself that the reason you're here is because of persistence. And one of the things that we always talk about is that verse that says, ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find knock and the doors will be open to you. And part of the reason that we're here where we are is because you've been doing those things. You've been asking and seeking and knocking on this door of surgery. And this has been the fruit of that labor. You've learned so many lessons over these last like three years of trying to figure this out. And the life you live and the choices you've made are part of your story and they're valuable and there's no reason that would change on the other side of surgery. The choices you've made in the pursuit of knowing yourself and loving yourself and living into your purpose can't be stopped by any individual choice that you're making. The track you're on goes beyond just you. It's for the beloved community. It's for the communities that I love. Black people, trans people, disabled people. Those communities all need representation from someone like me. I know I've benefited so much from other people telling their stories and I really wanna do that and help other people decide to make that choice or not for themselves. Of course, there's other content that I'm gonna make because like I said, I'm also black and disabled and trans is not all of my life. So that stuff will still be coming, but I also want to add more stuff about kind of where I am with recovery for surgery and why I made the decisions that I made and kind of all of the stuff that would have been helpful for me to know. So if you folks have any questions about surgery or general trans stuff or the intersections of black, trans, and disabled or uh, I don't know, any combination of questions that you guys might have, put them down in the comments and over these next few, like I guess it's not a few months, however long I decide to talk about this, I'll answer those questions. So yeah, I think that's pretty much what I have for this week. Um, I'll see you guys on the other side. Deuce.